Hey guys, welcome back. If you're new, my name is Allie and welcome to Beauty with a Purpose. So if you are new to my channel, my name is Allie. I upload three videos a week, beauty, Bible, and lifestyle. So if any of those interest you, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and let's get into today's video. So for today's video, I have for you guys an everyday glowy makeup, summer makeup look. So yeah, it's summertime. It's time to glow. It's time to shine. Let's get our summer on. So yeah, let's go ahead and get into applying this makeup so you can see what I used, how to get this glowy mm, look. Let's go. Okay, so the first thing we're going in with, obviously, is primer. And so I do have this one from my Ipsy from last month. So from my May Ipsy, I have this Avant Pro Collagen Pro. Pro it's called the Avant Pro Perfecting Collagen Primer. And so I did want to go ahead and try this out today. This is just what the tube looks like. And that's just what that looks like. They had a moisturizer that I kept getting inside of my Ipsy and my Boxy Charms that I, uh, my skin just didn't vibe with it. So maybe this one's unscented. I don't know. Maybe my skin won't do bad with this one. And then for priming spray from my June Boxy Charm, I have this Everyday Vacay, what is it called? Dewy Coconut Setting Mist. I'm wondering if this is going to be similar to the Elf one because if so, just stick to the elf one which used to be my jam and that's just what the packaging looks like oh and i burned myself don't mind that and yeah it's just what it looks like it's a really cute okay it's not it does not spray onto your face as aggressive as it sounds thank the lord it smells really good though it smells exactly like the elf one so far Right, and this is what the skin looks like. Already looking glowy and cute. <laughs> and I don't know what's making my skin feel so tight, especially if that Ciate London one is supposed to make your skin feel dewy. Um, something's making my skin feel, feel tight. Probably that collagen thing. And yeah, I burned myself yesterday on a pot handle. Okay, so now we're just gonna go ahead and go on with brows and I'm just gonna kind of speed through it. I'm using my e.l.f. brow pencil and my Milani Brow Pomade in Deep Brown, and this one is, does not, oh, yeah, it does, in Neutral Brown. Clean up my brows, I have this Tarte C Hydrating C Concealer. It's kind of called the Hydro Concealer. So I'm gonna use this to clean up our brows. I got this in June's Ipsy. So, I mean, that's kind of dark. I mean, I'm tan, but jeez. It's called light medium, honey, <laughs> light medium. This looks like straight up medium. Well, in the tube, why is it that in the tube, it always looks so much lighter than on the wand? Anybody got any answers? I will agree, it is hydrating. From what I see, it's not like super pigmented, just right off the bat, that's what I'm noticing. But it did it did do a good job, and you can tell that I did clean up my brows. Like it does look different, it did do a good job. Okay, so for eyeshadow, we're going in with the CoverGirl concealer. CoverGirl concealer, we're going in with the CoverGirl eyeshadow primer. And I want even the eyes to look glowy, kind of like in my Get Ready With Me where I had on the um, Naruto shirt. I like a brown, bronzy, glowy look. We're gonna go for something a little bit lighter since, you know, like the day's just starting. It's nine o'clock, 9.30. I have 50 minutes to finish filming. Brows took me 15 minutes. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and set down that primer with this shade, which is Lure. Oh, we're using the 
Makeup Revolution um, Forever Limitless Allure Palette. So I'm going in with this shade right here, Lore. Lore. I wanted so bad to use the palette that I got in my boxy charm for June again, but I was like, Allie, don't do it. Cause I actually got a palette in my June Ipsy, but it's more fall than summer, if you ask me. So I didn't want to use it today, especially not with needing like a glowy look. Okay, and now I'm going to take take this one right here, which is called Flash, and we're gonna buff that into our crease. Okay, so like for the outer edge and to deepen up that crease just a tiny bit, I'm gonna take um, Shine and Chance and mix them together. Okay, so that's all we're gonna really do. And then for the lid, um, I want something pretty bright. So I'm gonna go with Embellish right here okay so what i'm gonna do is i'm actually going to take a flat brush and go into embellish and spray it and see if i can get that like as intense as i'm really really wanting it like that's as good as it's gonna get oh no that made a big difference now that i can see it better on this side it's a lot better than dry with my finger that is actually really pretty color so now i'm gonna go ahead and go in with mascara and i'm gonna be using the thrive like liquid lash extensions and for lashes the kiss lash couture naked drama lashes in ruffle um, these are another oldie that I haven't used in a while. So I decided I would try them out because the last time I tried out my Kiss Zero One lashes and I was like, why did I stop using these for every day? Like, why? So I thought I would give these Kiss Ruffle lashes a try again. But yeah, I'm going to speed through mascara and lashes and I will see you guys when it's all done. All right, those are done. They came out super cute. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and go in with foundation. And again, since it's summer, we're going for that glowy look. You can use your SPF underneath your foundation. I'm using the Urban Decay Stay Naked Hydromaniac Tinted Glow Hydrator. So this is just what it looks like. I have the shade 40 Light Medium. So we're just gonna go ahead and go in with this. I was really hoping this still matched because y'all, your girl has really seen, looks like she's been sitting on the sun. This has all right coverage, especially just with the sponge. That's why I'm putting so much. And that's what we're gonna go ahead and blend in. Blending that in with my elf sponge. super duper light um don't know what to do we're just gonna build it up anyways because that is so light you know when i was all like "Ooh, i'm gonna get brown biscuit this summer i wasn't really thinking of the aftermath of not having hardly any foundations that would match me fun how fun now for concealer going back in with the tart c um, hydrating con hydro concealer we're gonna go ahead and try to make this work because I'm pretty sure this may be darker than the foundation I have on and it's the same exact color which is all right okay, this feels really creamy like now that I've put it on like underneath my eyes and stuff and we're just gonna obviously flip this around and use this end to blend it out oh I got lighter as I blended so that's good again it's super light coverage it's a hydro concealer it's not really meant to have a lot of coverage. It's really just to hydrate. My skin is so shiny. <laughs> Talk about glowy. I'm gonna try to build it up underneath the eyes just a little bit. Wow, I need to sit. <laughs> You guys, I forgot this entire time. 
I had a lip oil from my BoxyCharm that I was supposed to put on the entire time and it's just this Girlactic Rose Lip Oil. And it's super pretty. Like, I've already looked at it and it's super duper pretty. So this is just what it looks like. So stinking cute. It has a gloss. That's not an oil. If it is, that's the thickest oil I don't ever felt. What kind of oil they got in here? A whole seed oil? Benosa kernel oil, Ribis nigrums oil seed oil, Rubus ideas seed oil. It's thick. That's all I know. And there's a lot of words on there I can't pronounce. But okay, going in with bronzer because Lord knows. Lord knows. Lord knows. Lord knows. I need it. Going in with this. And I'm literally having to like dig my brush in there because this will not come out anymore. Don't know what happened. I don't know if I stripped the product on the inside or what. Okay, and now we also got this Peerlessy. Um, blush glow cheek BB cheek color with vitamin E and hyaluronic acid creamy lightweight buildable youthful glow for all skin types this is just what the packaging looks like we get a lot of peerlessy peerless day how do you say that word guys in my boxy chart in my box charms in my ipsies and they have really good products especially skincare products there's only one thing that I got from them that did not work out so this is just what the blush looks like and this is the color cool mauve that's kind of strange because the packaging is peach oh no comes out mauve so that's just what it looks like we are gonna go ahead and take a brush oh that's like a it's like a mousse texture can you see that so just applying that whoa this is cool toned it almost looks a little bit ashy on me almost but it looks really subtle and really pretty at the same time need a little bit more product and it's actually a little bit more matte because you see like how it kind of doesn't look as glowy as the rest of my face anymore. I like that. That's really cute and really good. That's really pretty. So now to set the face, we are going in with my Flower Beauty Powder. And we are going to go ahead and use these brushes that I got in my Ipsy just because, I mean, I already forgot to use them. So it was a Fair Beauty brush set and it just came with three different powder brushes. Came with a blending brush, uh, what is this called? A pressed powder brush and then a domed powder brush. And so we are going to be using these. Taking this one, we are going to smooth. I wonder what this looks like underneath the eyes with that Hydra concealer from Tarte. Wow, for it to be super hydrated under there, it is not creased bad at all. Like at all, like there's no settling into the fine lines. Like I have fine lines, but it's not settling into them. I'm just gonna take this brush and push it in. That's really pretty under there. And this brush fits perfectly under the eyes, I love it. Okay, now going in with the big powder brush. I have so many big powder brushes now. Yeah, that um, blush is way more matte than it is glowy for it to be advertised as a glowy, useful glow blush. So yeah, those brushes are really good, really soft. I actually have a lot of Farrah brushes. Like I have the, some of their eyeshadow, well, now I have an eyeshadow brush, but I have a lot of their face brushes. For instance, this one, there's another one somewhere, but I really like this one for highlighting as well. And I'll use it today so y'all can see. All right, you guys, so now for bronzer, I'm gonna go ahead and use this Ofra palette. And I'm gonna take the bronzer in here and we are just gonna go ahead and bronze up the cheeks, the face. Also, super random, but I have been loving the no bra deal. <laughs> like if I'm home, I'm not wearing a bra. And sometimes if I'm wearing a big enough shirt, I leave the house without a bra because your girl needs to buy bigger bras because I've been watching like all this stuff and doing all this research. And you were probably wearing the wrong bra size, especially if you've been measured at like Victoria's Secrets or something like that because they kind of measure you in order to fit you into their bras. Okay, I also got this from my boxy charm from my Ipsy for this month, and this is the 
K Voss Blushing Beauty Luminous Blush Palette. This is super pretty. This actually reminds me of the ABH one that I want so bad, just not so peachy. Okay, so I'm actually just gonna mix all three of these together and we're just gonna see what happens. Mix in, mix in, mix in, mix in. Maybe I should have did it this way. No, oh, really pretty. It matches that cream blush that I put on perfectly, actually. So cute. Whoa, when did that happen? Goodness gracious. All right, so that is super pretty. <laughs> but your girl went a little ham sandwich. Wow, wow. Me and blush. I don't think I'm supposed to use blush. I really don't. Okay, now we're going back into this palette, like I said, and we're gonna use the highlighter. And just for the fun of it, let's use my other Farrah brush and I'm just gonna kind of swirl these together. It's a mix in today. Ooh, okay, she icy. And on the inner corner, make this super glowy. Just rub that out a little bit so it's not like a harsh line. Wow, texture come through. Okay, so we're just gonna put some mascara on the lower lash line. We're gonna set the brows and I'm telling you guys, this little Tarte sketch and set, I love the brow gel on this thing. The, I mean, the wand is so small, like, oh, I love this brow gel. Okay, and now I am actually just gonna put on some more of this gloss because it's so pretty. And I mean, who wants to be, I mean, when you trying to be by a pool and be cute, who wants to worry about a lipstick? Not I. Not honestly, I don't even put all makeup to go to the pool because your girl trying to dive and swim. I'm not trying to go to the pool to be cute, I'm trying to go to the pool to be a child. Okay, and last but not least, we're gonna go ahead and set again with the Ciate London Coconut Dewy Setting Mist. That is one of those spritzers that wow, that feels wow. Okay. <laughs> That escalated quickly. <laughs> okay, that is one of those spritzers that you want to keep spraying on your face. Like, it feels so good. Wow. What a pretty glowy look. Like, look at that. Look at how pretty that is. This is the completed final look. Let me know, how do you feel about a bold lip in the summer? Or are you more like me, like throw on that gloss and rock them glossy lips type of girl like me? So yeah, you guys, I hope that you guys enjoyed this. This is a simple everyday glowy summer makeup look. It literally took me less than an hour. Like if I didn't have to keep stopping for product shots for my Ipsy unboxing, I feel like I could have got this done in like 30 minutes. But yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this. If you haven't already, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Also hit that subscribe button. And if you can, let me know down below what are some of your favorite summer makeup products. That way I can add them to my collection. So yeah, I love you guys. But always remember that Jesus loves you more. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Mwah.